Say so calling from Atlanta, say he miss me. Well, well, well. It's best in that private ad to give me. What's up, YouTube? It's Michael and welcome back to my channel. So would I even be Micah if I wasn't doing hips at all times? Like, but y'all, I have a Shein try on haul for y'all. First of all, I already opened the package, but I still want to show y'all the box because why not? <laughs> Post it for a thumbnail, be like. I'll be having to make sure y'all can't see my address because. Yeah, I have a huge winter Shein try on haul for y'all today. It's my first Shein try on haul of the new year, so. I don't know why I always do this now, but like, it's like my new thing. It's the way, ah, ah, ah. My ring light is broken right now, so we just gonna, I know I have like some cute jackets in here. I'm not even gonna lie. There's definitely some cute fits in here. Probably gonna wear some of this stuff this weekend because I'm going to New York City. But before we get started, make sure you like, comment, and subscribe, y'all. I feel like I have to bend down so y'all can see me. I, I like the setting for the, for the haul, so you know, when I back up, y'all can see everything or whatever. Maybe the gym? Been doing the damn thing, okay? Yo, I, ha I feel like I be having ADHD sometimes, y'all. Like, I get distracted so easily. Yeah, make sure you like, comment, and subscribe. Make sure you guys have your post notifications on. Also, yeah, I have like a whole entire like playlist on my channel of like all of my Shein try on hauls. So make sure y'all check that out. I'm gonna leave the link to like the playlist in my description box below. So yeah. All the links for everything in this video will be linked down below. And make sure you guys are using my coupon code Michael White 4. I also have another one. The first one is 15 Michael White 4 and there's another one. I dead don't know but I'm gonna leave it in the description box. Yeah I can use either or they're both 15% off save you some coins. Before we even get started with the she and try home I gotta put y'all on game y'all so Dossier sent me this package and if you don't know what Dossier is it's a perfume brand. I don't like how I have to bend down right now. We're just gonna change the vibe for right now because until I start trying on the clothes i just don't feel like bending down there we go i've worked with dossier before i remember they had like this one vanilla scent that i was obsessed with and i did think i got it again it's like an affordable luxury perfume brand if you're not in tune get in tune like if you don't know what dossier is you really out the loop when they told me they wanted to work with me again i got dumb hype because dossier is really that girl like <gasps> they sent me three i'm oh not too much on the Addy, y'all. So I have a 5% off code for you guys. I'm gonna leave it in the description box below because I'm not sure what it is, but I know it's 5% off. These are the perfumes. I'm mad hype. Like, I love perfume, y'all. I've really been getting mad new perfumes, y'all. Like, I don't know what's up with me and all these new perfumes, but like this Nicki Minaj one, Pink Friday. Yeah, my mom just got me this new YSL one for Christmas. Prada Candy, hands down, one of my favorite scents ever. And my favorite thing about Dossier is that it did give like expensive type of perfume, and it's not expensive. Like, it literally lasts all day. If you spray this, on you and you walk past somebody they're gonna be like mm, what they got on like they gonna yes this is the vanilla one that i wanted why it would be the first one that i opened iconic sense designer quality no markups this is literally i literally just said that like it's dead eyes designer quality and i have mad designer perfume so like you could trust me i know like the bath and body works perfume is cute and all for one two but like after an hour you can't smell it anymore like i literally hate that yeah so this is the ambery vanilla one hold on i don't even know why the lighting is like this it's 50 milliliters or whatever last time i had this it dead lasted me mad long definitely a great size this one it's like it said that it's inspired by like the ysl black opium scent so let's smell it <sighs> i missed this scent oh my god y'all don't even understand like i'm really a perfume girly so like i know y'all probably like mirafinin but like no like perfume is really like i'm not gonna spray it all over me yet because i gotta figure out which one out of the three that i actually want to wear today i'm already feeling for this one only because i've had this one before and it was like my favorite scent in that moment and i have mad perfume so <sighs> <laughs> Yo! Let me let me let me relax. But yeah, this one top tip, ten out of ten, like ten out of ten. I've never smelled these other two before, so like I'm showing a little bit of favoritism to the vanilla one because like you know I've had it before. I love the scent. You know we just get each other. The other two like I've never smelled these before, so you're gonna get like my actual like real initial reaction. This one is the floral pink pepper. I had pink in it, so and y'all know pink is my favorite. <laughs> color <laughs> so we about to see what this one gives same packaging okay, let's see mm, okay which one does this represent i mean represent what which one is this inspired by this is inspired by mm, dior miss your um miss dior but some dior perfume i don't know i don't i never owned a dior perfume yet nah this smells mad good hold on Nah, this is giving like rich bitch. Like, yo, all right, this is making it hard for me to even pick a fave. 
chef's kiss. Nah, this is it. Okay, so the vanilla one gives like a more sweeter vibe. This gives like grown, like sexy. Yeah, this gives like girly, cute, soft. This gives like grown, elegant, mature. All right, last one. This is Gourmet White Flowers. I think I, did I smell this one before? I don't know. This one is inspired by the Victor and Roll Flower Bomb perfume. And also y'all, when you get like these perfumes, it has like all of the ingredients and stuff in it. So I can't smell it anymore. Nah, what? Pink pepper, vanilla, white or hmm. I don't even know which is my fave, y'all. Floral pink pepper one is really potent. Like, it's really potent. It's strong. It depends on the vibe I'm going for. I feel like today I'm not really doing nothing crazy. So I might wear the vanilla one. Like, this just gives like a cute, subtle vibe. The pink pepper one gives like grown. Like, I'm you're going somewhere. Like, you're not just gonna wear this to go to the store. You have to wear this with like a purpose. The white flowers one gives like fake, like an everyday scent too. Thank you to Dacier for sending me these perfumes. Definitely been using it because I don't know like I'm obsessed with perfume so it definitely came in clutch with these but I'll leave the link for like all of these in my description box and make sure you check in the description box for the coupon code to save you some coin yeah let's get on with the she and try on haul now we can get into the try on haul the first item these army fatigue cargo pants I'm about to put them on and see how they fit. These? I'm not even gonna lie, y'all. I didn't really have, have like high hopes for these because you know she ain't be like a hit or miss with the pants. But y'all, these literally go all the way down to my ankles and then so like they're not high waters. And I'm dead surprised because I dead always be getting high waters. But for reference, I'm like almost 5'10. I'm like 5'9 and a half. So but hold on. I'm not gonna lie, this fit that I have on right now, tell me it's not a cute fit. I don't know if y'all can see my shoes, but that's Macu. She a bad she's shaking her panty. But now yeah, I'm definitely jacking these. Definitely gonna have to run this back in different colors. Cause I like the way these fit and they're old like the fact that they're not high waters like Yeah, I don't even understand how hard it is for me to find pants that are not high waters like it's almost impossible so All right enough of the tiktoks, but and it gave jet I don't have no complaints. I give it a 10 out of 10. I don't know what size these are. Everything in this haul is from Shein Sexy. So like, it's not even giving a regular Shein haul. It's giving Shein Sexy. This is like, I don't know. I've been wanting more like calm, casual, loose footing jeans. Cause I feel like I have mad skinny jeans. Like literally I have mad skinny jeans and I'm fake over the skinny jeans ever a vibe. Like it's, it's there if I need it, but like I need to expand and start wearing like looser fitting pants. So it's a yes for me. All right, y'all. Next is this shirt. Y'all, this shirt is mad cute. I feel like I've been wanting this shirt for mad long. Like, I've been seeing it. I've been seeing mad people pick style this shirt with mad different outfits and stuff. Now, yeah, I'm definitely jacking this shirt. This is in the size medium. I think the pants are also in the size medium. I forgot to say that. But, yeah, these are in the medium. I feel like I'm not gonna lie. This is dead. A fit. Ooh, this with some G Fazos? Nah, that's dead mad cute. I feel like this shirt gives like a cute like brunch vibe. Like I would definitely probably wear like a white bra with this only cause like you could definitely see the bra and I don't want to wear no bra unless like I have on some pasties. Like if I had pasties on, I'll probably wear no bra or like nipple tape or something like that. I definitely wouldn't wear this black bra. Like, I feel like that looks tacky. I don't like the way that looks. For the sake of this video, it don't really matter. Nah, yeah, this is mad cute. This is a fit. This is a look. It's giving, it's giving looks. I dad want to wear this to brunch on Sunday. Like, this is cute. This shirt is really mad cute. This shirt is a 10 out of 10 for me. I feel like I definitely like want to get the wrinkles out, even though it's like not that much. Nah, this would really be mad cute. Even with, with some McQueen. That's a fit. 10 out of 10 for me. I feel like I definitely, definitely, definitely need to get this shirt in multiple colors. Like, they have it in mad colors. One is not enough. Like, this shirt alone is mad cute. Like, no matter what you wearing on the bottoms it makes the fit you know like i'm definitely jacking this top like again okay y'all these are the next pants i'm not gonna lie i feel like they're not high waters but like they're literally like just making that cutoff mark like i'm wearing black sneakers so you dead can't tell actually i'm lying they're dead not even high waters you see how i get i'm just so used to everything being high waters that like everything just be seeming like high waters but it cut off right at the ankle i feel like the um the army pants were a little bit longer but no nah, this is cute i'm not used to um, low-rise pants like the gym been gymming. I feel like the whole reason why I didn't like low rise pants was because of like my stomach. But like, I did like it. I feel like this that fits mad cute. Like, I feel like it's probably gonna take me a minute to get used to the whole like low rise thing. Cause I'm just so used to like high rise pants. I actually really love high rise pants, but these are cute. I needed a pair of like black cargo pants. So it was given like, I wanted to see what was up. And she ain't be coming through with the pants sometimes. So I was like, you know what? Like, don't hurt to try. Y'all see the jet? Y'all can see the jet and everything, honestly, at this point. This will look mad cute with the white, um, 
the white palm angels bag tell me that's not a vibe Vibe all the time oh that's why i couldn't put the shirt on i didn't even know the shirt had a zipper right here i was over here struggling like nah yeah this is a vibe but nah yeah i'm jacking the cargo pants this is also on the size medium they fit true to size so i would give these probably like eight out of ten only because i'm still adjusting to the whole low rise thing and like the other pants were a little bit longer so aside from that i'm jacking them definitely given this next item i did wore this already because i just couldn't wait like do you see this the sherpa line black leather coat Y'all, huh, let me put it on. And a fake dead go. Nah, this would fake be a fit. I'm not even gonna lie. This would fake dead be a fit. Even though it's way too cold to be wearing this. Like, whole stomach is out. Tell me this jacket is not a vibe. Like, it's so cute. I love this jacket. Like, I already wore it a few times. Baby, I saw this and was like, yeah, no. This jacket is a must. Like, I don't know. She really be coming through. Like, first of all, this part is mad soft. And it's like, this jacket is mad inexpensive. Like, this is dead a vibe. And then go with the Palm Angels too. Like, this is dead a whole fit. This jacket is in a size medium but like it's that i'm not gonna lie like it's room in here like i like the way it fit like it's not too snug because if i wanted to wear a sweater underneath this i could so you know so if you're looking for a black leather jacket with some with a white fur trim this is it baby stay tuned for the pictures that i'm about to post on my feed y'all if you're not following me on instagram make sure you follow me at micah.leah because the pictures they're gonna be rolling in all right but not yet i'm jacking the jacket 10 out of 10 no complaints at all like. okay y'all this is the next item it's this unitar or like bodysuit or whatever jumpsuit type of thing or whatever it goes all the way down it's supposed to go all the way down actually but these are like od od high waters like i dead can't even wear this with like some heels or something because it just will look stupid i'm not gonna lie y'all like i dead fake baited with getting this in a size large i don't know like i feel like i have too much room like i feel like it definitely make my body look good but if this was in a size like medium this would dead be like skin tight and it would give like body for real you see that? I feel like this is definitely something that you would definitely wear in the winter though. Like you cannot wear this anytime. Like the inside material is given like, it's mad warm. If I was to wear this, I will wear this with like my rigs. Cause you know, I could hide the fact that it's like high water. It's definitely gotta hide that. I would give this like an eight out of 10. I feel like if I got it in a medium, y'all, it would've ate down. Like it would've been mad snug, like snatching my body. But the large is, it's all right. It's not bad, but I know like what I've wanted it to give. It's calm, I'll give it eight out of 10, but she's looking that. Yeah, baby, the gym. Had him about two months ago. Said his name was Jim and that he. All right, y'all. Now this. Like, can we get into the long black leather trench? I don't know why. Like, I'm really into the whole like leather with like the fur trimming. Like that is mad cute to me. But I wore this on New Year's and I didn't even get any pictures in it. Like. I'm tight <laughs> cause this jacket really ate down like like this really give like on some grown woman shit for real like are you dumb tell me this don't eat <laughs> nah this really ate though like with the fur and the fur is mad soft too y'all this that ate this isn't a size medium I don't know like I'm just jacking this it gave what it needed to give and it come with a belt I definitely forgot to bring this with me to the city on New Year's but but the belt ate because of the material of the bodysuit it's not you can't really get the full effect like it's not really snatching the waist it needs to snatch tell me this is not mad cute like this day gave new year's too like the vibe of this coat really gave like it's new year's eve i hate that y'all could see the reflection in the mirror but 10 out of 10 are you dumb i don't know how i feel about the belt like i don't know why i don't know if it's because of the bodysuit or what but it eats either way like open clothes whatever i'm jacking it yeah i definitely will be retaking um some pictures in the outfit that i wore on new year's i don't know when but the gram gotta see that look like that look ate down so this a are you dumb all right <laughs> next item all right y'all so this is the next item well items y'all this is that mad cute i feel like this definitely gave like she and sexy so y'all like this strapless like top or whatever i did think the top is upside down i'm not gonna lie but i don't have time to switch it I'm, yeah i feel like this is definitely given this is mad cute also has like slits at the knees that's also mad cute i feel like this one looks mad cute with these red and black ones like this I actually got this because I'm like I have these sneakers and I barely be wearing these because I don't really be having stuff to match with it but this is dead a vibe with the red tail fizzy like it's a vibe I feel like this is definitely mad cute I'm definitely jacking this is a size medium it has like the zipper on the side or whatever at first I was struggling I'm like how but it has like this thing where you can make it like either like a regular pants or whatever 
right? Which is cute. Or you can make it like a V cut type of type of vibe. I feel like this gives like sexy. Like I don't know anything with like a V. Yeah, you know, red tie. Are you done? But yeah, I was trying to make this like as V as possible. Like I feel like that is mad cute. Ten out of ten, babe. Yeah, and it also also goes all the way down to my feet. I don't have no socks on right now, so not too much. But this is cute. I'm jacking this. I don't know what I would wear this to. Like I feel like this is giving like maybe like a concert or something, right? I don't know. <laughs> it's a vibe. It fits really well. The top has like a spandex thing on the top and bottom, so it doesn't like fall or whatever. But and once I get these abs from the gym, oh yeah, I'm gonna be on. Unstoppable. The next item, y'all, is this denim jacket. I don't know where my denim jacket went, so I needed a new one. <laughs> Let's see. This this jacket's in a size medium. Oh, this is cute. This does fit like my other one. All right. This do not go with what I have on. Like, I would not. Like, this just doesn't go. I feel like denim normally goes with everything, but I don't like the way this looks. Like, with the blue and the red. I don't know. I'm, it's not. I'm not feeling it. I don't know. Is it the way I'm wearing it? Like, what if, maybe I have to wear it, like, off the shoulder. This is like a spring fit. Like, it's not even getting the winter. <laughs> okay. That look a little better. It gives a little more. I really just needed a denim jacket, y'all. I'm not even gonna lie. Like, I feel like a denim jacket is an essential in every girl's collection, like any girl's wardrobe. Like, if you don't have a denim jacket, then like, are you even a girl? <laughs> like, do you even know how to dress or play? I feel like denim jackets are mad cute. Like, if you like wear them off the shoulder like this, right? Mad cute, mad cute. I like the color of the denim too. Like some denim jackets don't be giving cute denim. Like 10 out of 10. Next item. All right, y'all. So this is the last item. This purse. I already wore this as well. I feel like it looks way better when you have like mad stuff in it. Cause one, this bag fits mad stuff. Like I'm not even gonna hold y'all. Like I didn't have my, my light, wallet, keys, lip gloss, gum, rolling essentials, including a grinder. Like I had mad stuff in this bag and like it all fits. So definitely a good bag. When I first opened it, I don't like how flimsy it looked. It was like, eh. But it can't, it fake gives like the vibe of like a Balenciaga bag. Obviously, it's not Balenciaga, but it gives the vibe of one. And it's cute. Like, I like the colors. Nude bag or whatever. Definitely wouldn't wear it with this. Like, it does just. I feel like I wear this bag an 8 out of 10 only because it is a little flimsy until you fill it up. If I don't have like a lot of stuff to put it in this bag, I wouldn't wear it. Like, you know, I only, I won't only wear this bag if I'm like carrying a lot of things. So, like, it could fill the shape of the bag. But other than that, the bag is cute. Like, I feel like I can't. Can't really see the full vision because they don't go with the with the fit but when i wore it it was dead mad cute like i wore it with these uggs like mad cute like mad cute but yeah eight out of ten so that pretty much wraps up this she and trial haul i feel like i definitely have some cute ass pieces in this haul make sure y'all get into them again everything for like all these items will be linked down below so i'm in the middle of brushing my hands okay y'all now yeah make sure y'all tune in, in the links in my description box because they have all of these stuff in mad different colors y'all already like you know if you shop on Shein and y'all know like they have them in like mad different options i'll be trying to like step out the box sometimes of things that i normally would wear so it's not giving like mad basic and everything is black even though i had a lot of black stuff in this haul but i feel like winter just gives like you can't go wrong with black feel me like definitely jack and everything in this haul make sure you guys are using my coupon code 15 micro white 4 and there's another one but i will have it in the description box below because i don't know off the top of my head so i hope you guys liked everything make sure y'all comment saying what was your favorite piece from this haul i hope you guys like this video and i'll see you guys in my next one